Cyclone Batsire slammed into Madagascar's eastern coastline with heavy rains and wind speeds of 165 kilometers per hour, flooding roads and leaving several houses completely submerged. Tens of thousands of people have been displaced. It was early morning. We were still sleeping. Our landlord came to tell us that water was rising. We got up to move the furniture. All while, the water continued to rise. The house started cracking. Some of our furniture was still upstairs, and the cracks started to get worse. Some of our belongings have been destroyed. Residents use tree branches to measure the depth of the floods. The damage compounded by the destruction left by another cyclone two weeks earlier, which killed dozens and displaced 130,000 people. The damage is big, the wind was very strong, and even if people took care to protect their belongings, there had been a lot of damage. Aid agencies have prepared food to distribute to those in need with UN evacuation flights on standby. Children and worried parents fill the floors of this local evacuation center. We live on the hill on the edge of a cliff. The wind was strong, but our house is also strong. Early in the morning, there was a landslide. To be safe, the head of the neighborhood told us to go to the evacuation center. That's why we're here. Madagascar has recently suffered drought, another country hit by extreme weather as a result of climate change. Jillian Wolf, Al Jazeera.